you are. Time, Union Square, your name is? Maria. Maria, Maria has a farm. Absolutely. Well, it's not my farm. I work here at the market. It's my, uh, one of my friend's father's farm. Yeah. Great. But uh, in Roscoe, New York, it's in the Western Catskills of New York. And nice. at one point, we were growing, the farm was growing 16 varieties of Peruvian potatoes that uh, were brought back for us uh, from some people that we knew. But it wasn't done through the proper channels. So, uh, APHIS, the Agricultural Association, that like protects um, from like bugs and other things coming into the country, like from like people not getting the, like seeds through the proper channels. Right, right, right. They uh, saw the press that we were getting because no one else had Peruvian strained potatoes in the country. So, we ended up in uh, Martha Stewart's magazine. And uh, they saw that, and they were like, "Oh, you have to. We're gonna have to come fumigate your farm. You have to like cover up all the potatoes." And so he was like, "By the time you get up here, I'm gonna have them all buried." So he buried all the crops, the 16 varieties. But he managed to. Um, he was a graduate of Cornell's Ag School, so he managed to get seven strains of the Peruvian potatoes through the proper process at Cornell Ag, and he got them like made sure they were like clean, uh, like no bugs or anything, no viruses being brought in. And so we got seven strains properly set up to be grown in the U.S. And so right now we grow the purple Peruvian and the, uh, the ruby crescent. Unbelievable. So we have papas de Peru acá in Union Square. Ahí está la prueba. La están creciendo acá. Y la gente le encanta. People just love it. They can't have enough for it. It's a little cold, a little frío. Very nice. So the name is Potato Chips Farm Maine. <laughs> 